two experiences can even happen to the fullest profits? I, I wasn't uh, broadcasting my personal experience, you asked me. No, I didn't say you're broadcasting it, okay. but I'm saying when you speak to a Christian yeah. or you're non-Christian, non yeah. how can you prove what you believe is the truth? How can you prove that? Uh, I'm, I'm, I, I, ha I know what you're saying is that what I have to say is subjective, of course, it is subjective. It is subjective. But you <laughs> asked me, the first question that you asked yeah. me was when am I going to become a mother? Yeah, alhamdulillah. And I said to you, never because I've been enlightened. Now, once I've experienced the truth in my life, I don't think personally that there's anything that you can say that could bring me out of that belief because it's become factual in my life. Yeah, but you just agree it's subjective. What can be can okay. change? Okay. What is subjective? If you, if, is you, it, if you can change it, go for it. I'm listening. Okay. Is it possible for someone to be perfect and become baby someone changes nappy? Is it, say that again. Is sorry. it possible for someone is almighty, perfect, okay. has no beginning, no end, the greatest, yeah. the creator, the all powerful becomes baby, someone changes nappy. There is a purpose that you obviously... Right? I'm asking you, forgot my purpose. Is it possible? It is possible, yeah. It's possible, yeah? yeah it is right. possible. Almighty. It, 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 in perspective, so more powerful. Jesus Christ Give coming into this earth, born as a baby. If that's what you're saying, but the way, the, the choice of words that you're saying to make it sound foolish, it is possible. So you're making it sound foolish. Okay, when, when he was a baby, was he all powerful? He was fully God and fully man. Fully yeah. God. So Mary was changing the nappy of God. Okay. Yeah, but the purpose. May Allah help you. To, no, so I you're can't. You're not listening. Yeah, purpose wise, yeah. The purpose that he done that was the purpose that he come onto this earth to be a bond servant to show us as an example of how we should live. The son of God, fully God and fully man. So that's how the animal should live. Does God know how the animal should, should live? Yeah. What do you oh. mean on that? Okay. Does God know the perfect knowledge? He knows in detail, better than anyone knows how the animals live. Of course it does. Okay. Does God know how we should live our life in detail, perfectly? Does He know? Yeah. yeah of course he does. So there's no need for Him to become to become something which negates His. his it's not about Him. Let me, it's let me about us knowing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The animals. So, that's what I'm saying. So we don't. Animals don't know as well, so they should become. If someone says God become a rat, if tell someone says God become a rat, the purpose is, even though he said God become a rat, is a paradox because why? A rat is an animal that is created. God is not. Uh, God is created. The he become a creation. What you are saying, the Creator who created everything, I'm created. Okay. That is a paradox. So if someone said to you, you know what? I believe God become a rat. You know. Do you know why? I'm not going to allow you to prove to me intellectually why God is impossible for God to become a rat because that doesn't make any sense. I'm going to say the purpose being because he wants to teach a rat how to be a rat. Would you see, accept that? See, see what it is, what it is. Of course, the way that you explained it, of course it's not going to make sense. But the truth is, is that Jesus Christ... Why is it not going to make sense? No, so to cut you. Why is it not going to make sense? Lamb of God, no, no, why? take away the sins of no, this world. No, hear me. Okay. Why is it making sense? We could not do this. Why is it not making sense? It doesn't make sense. But it doesn't make sense. The truth is, is by ourselves, we cannot stand in a place that we are righteous with God. We can do all this religious stuff. What about the time of Moses? What about the time of Moses? In front of all of these people to say that we're in this righteous and holy place and represent ourselves before man. But the truth is, is no man in their own ability can stand in that position. That was the reason why Jesus was the job Christ of righteous. Came. Was the job because righteous? He was holy. Was the job righteous? He was righteous. The prophet job. That when he He's died nice on the cross, there was an exchange that happened. God died that on the cross. We can now step into that place of holiness and righteousness based on what Christ done by faith. So, so no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. About religion. So are you telling me? No, no, wait. No, look, no he's, he's preaching. No, no, no. I'm listening. So are you? No, 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 no. Was the job of righteous man? Prophet Job was a righteous man. Was, was Prophet Job a righteous man? In the Bible said Job was a righteous man. To the best of his abilities, yes. He was not in need. No, 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 no. He was, need, he was not in need of to become a baby for Job to become a righteous. So he was being collapsed okay. intellectually okay. and sexually. Let me finish. You said that because we know that righteous, so came into flesh to show us righteousness and to that for our sins because we cannot bear the sins. However, there's many passages in the Old Testament. God never died for them and God called them a righteous. So therefore, you believe in is wrong and sexually he got and guess the old testament i can explain that to you so when when the john the baptist said behold the lamb of god which has come to take this way the sins of the world the people of that day understood what the lamb of god meant 
and I'm going somewhere to answer your question. They understood what the Lamb of God meant to be the sacrificial system that was in place in them times. Now, when we look at the sacrificial systems that was in place, what we need to understand is that sacrificial system was a foreshadow of Christ. So when one put faith into the sacrificial system, it was a natural manifestation at the time that something happened in the spirit. Hence why it said, you have to ask my question. hence why I am, hence why That's it why said, Christian before left the foundations of the world, the Lamb of God was slain. What was my question? You were talking about was Job righteous? No, that was not my question. I passed that already. Okay. I was. My, I said to you clearly that in the Old Testament, in the Old Testament, that was your question. You're the, allow me to finish now. In the Old Testament, because you know Christians have to give it to them. They're good at preaching, but I'm not oh, the point. I was going somewhere. No, no. But you didn't the Old Prophets and Messengers in the Old Testament, yeah, they were called righteous. What you even no, no, to wait, do wait. Is give you a sentence allow, instead of allow me to, myself. That's what you want me to do. All the prophets and messengers, I challenge you right now. Show me where the prophet and the messengers in the Old Testament, they were saying we cannot be righteous until someone died for our sins. Go on. That's my question. And I'm going to explain it my way. Not no, 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 no. Answer my to. question. Me I right am answering you a question. Because you know you're going to answer. You want me to answer it in a sentence so your cameras can make me look silly. No, why are you scared then? I'm not scared. I'm talking. You can ask you. ask me any, any question. No, I don't want me stood here. That, that's why you said you said okay, you don't want to answer in sentence. Let me explain it in a way. No, no. That ask I know how to answer your no, question. Do you have? Or do you do explain. Okay. Show me. Again. No, no, let me repeat. No, let me repeat again. No, let me repeat again. Show me any prophet in the Old Testament say you cannot be righteous and you die for your sins. Show me. Say again. I didn't ask you that question. That's not my question. My question. My question was to you. My question was to you clearly. Show me in the Old Testament which prophet or messenger in the Old Testament say you cannot be righteous until someone died for your sins. They operated in the sacrificial system that was in time in that place. I didn't ask you that question. So how do, what I didn't ask you. So I'll tell you. No. I'll show you. Works, uh, in the Old Testament, the Bible it teaches you that if you, in, is that you? Okay, if you commit sin, if you commit sin, if you, if you, if you, if you, if you commit sin, if you commit sin and you turn away from it and you do rash actions, God will accept your repentance. No one should die for your sins. My point here clearly, the Old Testament teaches you anyone hung himself or died on the cross is being cursed. Yes, and the Old Testament teaches you that you should be responsible for your sins. No one should be responsible for no one's sins. Okay. So my question was to you clearly, can you show me in the Old Testament, you believe clearly go against the Old Testament. Okay. My brothers and sisters, the Old Testament, okay, does the Old Testament teach you to be responsible for your sins? So, so are we changing the question? Are you not going to let me answer? I'm going to show that's the same one. Okay, let me repeat again. Okay. That's the Old Testament. The prophets and the messengers were teaching the people you cannot be righteous until someone there died for you. Sin, there let, was a sin covering that was done through the sacrifice. Let me finish. Of let, me let me finish. You I'm cannot be. Your question. You cannot be righteous until someone died for your sins, and you should not be responsible because someone will die for your sins. Show me that. Okay, so. Are we, are we going to acknowledge that there was a sin sacrifice that was done for animals? Read it from there, yeah? What, agree? Yes. What, what, what is it you're asking the me to read? The Okay, brilliant. For the life, and this is Leviticus 17, 17 yeah, 11. It says, For the life of the flesh is in the blood that I have given it to you upon the altar to make an atonement for your souls, for it is blood that makes an atonement for your souls. No, no, come, 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 come. Come, we just give it to him. Let me read it. It's his Bible. I was giving him his Bible. Come, 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 come. <laughs> and the Lord spoke to Moses. And now we're going to show the contradiction now, yeah? Look at that. He gave I him look. Look what he showed. No, no. Let, 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 let me finish. Let me finish. You know, look, look, he's smiling because he knows why he's coming. No, no. Let, 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 let. 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 Let, 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 and the Lord spoke to Moses, speak to Aaron. I like to, that you know your Bible, bro. I uh, know, and the Quran as well, mashallah. To, look, so we go back, yeah? It speaks about God spoke to Moses, yeah? So Moses, because what you just did, you just said, for the life of the flesh is in the blood, yeah? What was that about? Is that about a man or was it about the sacrificing of the sheep? It was and sheep. It's not yes, a man. You see what? No, no, no. I'm yeah, asking a question. Someone dying for your sins. That is not the teaching of the Old Testament. There is a Jewish people here. Yeah, Please, we can. No, wait, wait, wait. Just, wait. I'm, I'm go I agree. Go look, I, I'm not negate. There is some yeah, sins. Wait, wait. I look. Do you let me finish then. The answer three times. So you're aware. Yes. Yeah. My point here. Yeah. My let's point here. Let's not have a. Here is that this is. As the Jewish people tell you about the Old Testament, there is an intentional sin and there's intentional sins. Some sins 
what you do is an act of worship to sacrifice the sheep and will sins forgiven. But not every sin will be forgiven. My point here is, you believe someone died for your sins. Uh -huh. In the Old Testament, that is not the teaching. Okay. You should be responsible. I'm asking you a simple question. In the Old Testament, does it teach you to be responsible for your sins? Someone should die for your sins. It talks about a sacrificial system. I ask you a question. Brother, in the, in the Old Testament. I'm giving okay, you the Testament. Yes. Does it teach you? Have you read Leviticus? Okay, let, have, let, me, right? let me read something for you, you to understand. Read Leviticus, right? let, me, let me read something. So now you're going on to 1820, yeah? Okay, 1820. Oh, he's okay. got a script in his hand. Look, he's got a script. 1820. <laughs> okay, let us hear, my brothers and sisters. My question was simply Does in the Bible, does in the Bible teach you should someone die for your sins? Okay. For your sins, all of it, yeah? Okay. Does that teach you before I expose you here? I'll read it. No, does it or oh, not? Oh, I'll read it, man. Okay, listen. It doesn't teach you to be, teach you to be responsible for your sins, yeah? Okay, let us read. Uh, 20, uh, 21. But if a wicked man, or before that, 2020, the soul who sins shall die. And we know every person die, regardless if you sin or not. True, true. So what does that mean, shall die? What does that mean? Explain that to them or shall I explain that? Can you issue, your, okay. this is your sermon, man. Yeah, yeah, explain that. So should die meaning you would not be living eternal life eternal, in paradise, yeah? Mm -hmm. So because why? Even every soul should die. So just to make that clear. So every, uh, let's go back. 20. Uh, it's not, there, yeah? 20, yeah. The soul who sins shall die. The son should, no, should not bear the guilt of the father. If you commit sin, your father should not be responsible for it. But he sent out the, all the, the Christianity, every Hitler, the biggest, the biggest murderer in the history, if he believed in Christianity, Jesus died for his sins. Watch this. Watch this, yeah? So let us read again. But if a wicked man turns from all his sins, which he has committed, keep all my status, and does what is lawful and right, he shall surely live. He should not die. None of the transgressions, uh, none of the transgressions which he has committed shall be remembered against him. Uh, it's small writing, my brother. Against, uh, uh, against him because of the righteousness which he has done. He shall live. Do I have any pleasure at all? So my point here is clearly, if you're a wicked man and you turn away from your wickedness and you do righteousness, righteousness, your wickedness should not be held against you. Mm -hmm. And this goes along with the Quran, that if you do righteous actions, you, and you repent away from the from the sins, that sins will not remember against you. Okay. Allah forgive those sins. Yeah. So now, in the Old Testament, clearly, there is no passage that says, you cannot be righteous until someone died for your sins. For your sins. So my question again, here the Bible for you again, for can you show you. us where in the Bible, in the Old Testament teaches you that you cannot be righteous until someone, no sacrifice, because sacrifice is an act of worship. Someone died for your sins, for all your sins. Even sacrificing the sheep doesn't not mean some all your sins be forgiven. Okay, so, the so platform for you. I, I, I want to let you know that I feel that you went off a couple of times, but so I had the same respect to show you grace and yeah, say no, nothing. No. So when I'm going to speak now and you feel as if I'm going off, have grace to let me finish. Can you respect that? Uh, I okay, don't know, but I have to pin you thank down. Thank you very much. I didn't say thank you very much. Thank you very much. I will pin you down. Okay, brilliant. As thank long as you ask my question, yeah? Okay, I will so, answer your question. But before you tell us your last story. Give me a couple of minutes. I'm not going to tell my last story. You're being silly now, bro. You didn't quote it fully. So, so, you didn't quote it fully. Let me finish. Okay. okay. I, wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, I know, wait. Are you going to come in and show us where in the Old Testament? In this verse. No, no, in the old, in this verse, that someone should die for your sins, all of it. Come Can in. you acknowledge? Come in. Can you acknowledge? Yeah, come in. This is the question, question yeah? Someone should die for all your sins. Yeah. A person or blood? A person, a person. No, a sacrifice sheep is active for sheep. I know that. It's not answering. So you're not letting him answer. He's going to say this. He's going to say this. Yeah, come back. Yeah, come back. He's not going to acknowledge. He's not going to acknowledge anyway, it. He's not going to acknowledge it. Anyway, go on. So you can answer it. He's going to answer the, the same way I am, but you're so, not letting so, so, okay, it. Okay, no problem. It's a person, yeah? Oh, it's a person. The, no, it's, I'm here. Yes. That's like me saying, unless you're going to talk about a pink shoe, don't talk. Oh, it's not no, about no, shoe, no, it's not that. Talk. It's not that because... No, no, it's not that. Let me just clarify. Just let me speak. Let me clarify something. I like his voice for a minute. Let me clarify. I don't know. It's not... Of course I like my voice because it's my voice. Oh, you need to hide my voice? Come on, man. Would you hate yourself? Come on, yourself and let him speak, bro. What? Someone like himself is going to be arrogant? Come on, man. But I'm just... Let me speak. 
I'm going to show you something. Everyone else has let you speak, bro. I just, I just want to emphasize something. Because you misunderstand me. I don't I, misunderstand you. No, yeah, you did. Because you, you said well. to me, you said to me about the pink something. No. What, what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, is I've tried. Uh, I'm yeah, I'm trying bring the astronomy. Bring the astronomy as well, yeah. I've tried. Okay, no, no, no. Don't say we misunderstand me. Because you can be the animal sacrifice system to you, but you've not accepted. Let me explain, just for a moment. No, it says, John the Baptist Are you going to ask him? No, the Old Testament. John the Baptist said the Old Testament. I'm coming with no, you. No, 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 no. He's no, you come. Be fair. He's going to finish. Yaps, Brother. Don't okay. else okay. you, bro. You I'm going to listen to what you got to say, bro. Yes, you're just still waste of time. You two waste of time. Listen, it's a waste of time because you're not getting it the way you want. No, but what I'm saying... Listen, so it says, John the Baptist said... So you come and say, you going to ask the question. The Lamb of God. To you now. I don't interrupt good. you. The lamb right, take care. We don't talk to you. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. All taken. Now we talk to you. Come because it's no. Mark, simply do not. It's cool. Yeah, yeah. It's cool. 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 It's c